Hi, this is Tutor Nick P, and this is suffix 19. Uh, the suffix today is ability, A-B-I-L-I-T-Y as a word ending. Okay, somebody wants a screenshot, do it right now, let's get right to it. Uh, the suffix ability is added to a verb to form nouns to mean one has the suitability for, an inclination for, or simply meaning uh, able to be done. Even the word suitability itself, a lot of times when you have ability, you will probably have the um, able, A-B-L-E, as the adjective too. Like you could, something could be suitable, but the noun would be suitability. All right, let's continue. Uh, so here's the first example, absorbability, the state or the degree of being absorbed, something could be absorbed. Uh, here's the example, Bounty. Now, Bounty is a famous paper towel company in the U.S. Bounty used to advertise their paper towels absorbability is better than others, so better than their competitors. So their paper towels could wipe up more liquid. You know, each sheet of paper towel is more absorbable than the other paper towel companies. That's what they used to claim. I'm not sure it's true, but that's what they used to claim. All right, let's go on. Achievability. Well, able to be achieved, able to be done. Uh, the achievability of that plant is not likely, so they don't think it'll work out. Affordability is another very common one. The extent to which something could be afforded, you know, be, be able to be paid for. If interest rates ever rise to a double-digit number, that means like above 10%. You know, now interest rates are so low, and they've been so low for so many years. Uh, you know, but, you know, if you went back 30, 40 years ago, they used to have double-digit interest rates. Uh, the affordability of houses will be out of the reach of the average home buyers because most people buy their home according to their monthly payment. And if the loan interest was a double digit, it would be far more than people could afford with the prices we have today. The only way people would be able to buy houses at that point is if the price of the house went down a lot. Uh, but that's what they mean by affordability. Okay, good. Uh, electability, you know, uh, the capability of a candidate to be elected. So how electable is that person? Um, that candidate had too many scandals. His electability level is very low because he had a lot of scandals in the past. All right. And the last one here, infectability, the ability to be infected, you know, especially by a disease or something like that. Uh, that disease is supposed to be highly contagious, you know, it could spread easily. The infectability rate is high, or at least that's what they say. Okay, anyway, I hope you got it. I hope it was clear. I hope it was very informative. Thank you for your time. Bye-bye.